Hi everyone! Thank you for joining me today. We're playing on Pal World. And from my last episode to this episode, I did move my base. Um, I, you can see I built a little little hut back there. And don't really have a whole lot. I moved it from... Where am I? Where I had it right here. I didn't move all that far. I'm actually in a spot that I thought about building, but my ultimate goal, I believe, is to get right up here or maybe even up top. It's This one's a little bit better protected, but for right now, I'm, I moved here. And I really wanted to build up there on that flat spot, which is literally right here. However, you can't place a PAL box up there because it says too close to a boss arena. Uh oh. Oh. Um. Um. <laughs> Where are they coming from? It's my first raid. Alright. What do I have for arrows? 29. Not a lot. Coming from up that direction. Oh, heavens. Do I, what do I have for pal balls? 51. Okay. Oh, I don't know what this. These guys are going to wreak havoc from my base. So I very much could die, and most of my pals die with them. Ah, uh, kept showing. I want one of these at least, hopefully. As you can see, that spear is spinning. Well, uh, maybe not. Ooh, everybody's injured or demise. Yay! Survived my first, um, my first raid. Cool! <laughs> uh, oh, minor injury, so it's not horrible. Okay. Lee's Punk. And I did get a Jolt Hog Crist. I don't know if I got it when... Yeah, I think I did when I was last. Yeah, I think I did. I'm not sure. But... So I separated out some of the benches. Um... Hmm... Put the bed. Alright. But I think the biggest goal is I want to do is to get a lot more pals. So for an upgrade I need oh I can upgrade. Oh, let's do that. So I need a berry plantation and deploy a pal to work at my base. So I need a berry plantation. Okay, so where should I put that? Do I have it unlocked? I do. Sweet. Um, I don't foresee this being as a permanent base, but for progression's sake, let's build. I don't really know where to put it, so I'll put it right here. And we have two lamb balls coming over to help build, so sweet. Okay, I'll let them finish building. I should help them, but... Because they'll literally drop what they're doing and go and help. Which is great. Um... There is one pal that I absolutely want to get. Um... I do have enough to make a ranch. I'm going to do that right now. A ranch is absolutely an invaluable tool. So, how long is it going to take to build this? Oh, good heavens. A long time. I'll let them do it while I go and look for some pals. What did I have on me again? Um, I have a lamb ball. Jolt hog, Chris, Fox Sparks, and a lease pump. I don't remember what the least punk does. Least punk. When activated, six tenths determine nearby dungeons. That's decent. Poison blast. Okay, fine. Uh, 
But what I want is a Vixie. And what the Vixie is great at doing is if you put them in the farm, they dig up stuff from time to time. What I've found playing on Xbox and playing a little, thinking or, or a little bit on a single a single player. This is obviously single player, but playing around, I notice that they have dug up pal balls and arrows, so you don't have to necessarily build a lot of regular pal balls. They'll just constantly dig it up for you. Now are you going to capture it? Spinning? Yes. Spinning? Yes. Perfect. Oh, and it's nighttime. I should probably go and go to sleep. These guys have actually pretty good aim. 63. Spinning. Yep. Spin again? Yes. Perfect. And what I mean by spinning is that center ball in the middle. If that is spinning, uh, let's let's go rest at bed real quick. We I still love that. Um, <laughs> I don't know why it took me so long to figure it out, but wow, that is so helpful, and you travel pretty fast. But no need playing at night. Where? Excuse me, I'm getting a little bit of a cold, and it's driving me insane. But a little more dangerous things come out at night, but. At times, something useful as well. You can get the daydreams. Um, oh my goodness, I'm forgetting the name of them now. Uh, oh well, I hope I'll find them. Or maybe it'll come back to me. Either way, can't remember it right now. Hungry. Oh, did we forget to eat? Of course we did. I wish there was a way besides hitting escape to exit certain menus, like if you use F to open up a box, to press F to close the box again. That would be handy. Alright, so let's see what I can find. And I do want to go into a cave, however, I'm only level 7. And I think those are level 13 caves? I mean, ooh, there's Vixie. I would really, really like to capture one of them. Maybe both of them. And hopefully not kill them. Come on. Capture. Spin. Yes. Spin again, please. Awesome. I'm hoping I can get... Ooh, my shield's gone. Hoping I can get one where it's not spinning and you can see where it will drop out. Okay, spin. Yep. Spin again. Yes. Awesome. Okay, so we got two Vixies. Perfect. <laughs> and you get bonus XP as long as you're under 10 for each particular pal. And that scales with your level. And you can get a tremendous amount of XP. Sparklet. Okay. I'm... Crazy enough to try it. Don't kill it. Spin. Yep. Spin. Yes. Perfect. The game is going to prove me wrong here. I don't get it. Oh my, where are you running to? And I missed. Go figure. Okay, is it going to spin? Yes. And no, it didn't spin. And of course, it wasn't anywhere where you could see the ball. Go figure. Spin, yep. Spin, yes. And capture. Okay. I wish I'd have been a little less in front of that tree, but... Yeah. What do we have here? Oh, another... Castaway Journal, day one of two. Um, how many more of these do I have? 42. 
I don't know what these guys do again. I don't remember. Oh, not the rush oars. They're not... They're actually my least favorite. Well, besides the dire howls. Why don't I just put out... Oh, I have no more arrows. Ooh, boy. Oh, I didn't mean to throw out a pal ball. Okay, spin. Yes, spin. Oh, cool. <laughs> I meant to throw out uh, the least punk. Which apparently I, I did not do. Another Vixie. And I have no more arrows. Um, Let's try a Fox Spark. Ooh. I missed a Pal Ball. And a chest. Hmm. Copper key. Do I have a copper key? I do have a copper key. Awesome. And we got a cloth schematic. These are wonderful. Because you can get these all the way up to legendary. I'm just not sure where you get them. I mean, they drop in different chests. And some bosses drop different schematics too. But this cloth outfit will be better than the one I'm wearing. And if I remember when I get back to base, I will hopefully demonstrate or show. Maybe. Maybe not. Could be wrong. Alright, so let's throw out the fox sparks and see if I can capture a black. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh no no. Okay, how about how about the how about a Vixie? I wanna capture some Vixies. Please just attack. Oh, I do have some arrows. I don't know why I was thinking I didn't have any arrows. Silly me. Oh, I didn't have arrows. Where did I get arrows? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, you're too powerful. I didn't take into account that a fox part was going to actually hit it. Well, shoot. Okay. Ooh. Can I take on a... Well, you know what? Worst, worst case scenario, I die. Yeah. Oh, Vixie. You know what? I'm going to put you away. <laughs> yes, I'm easily distracted. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. I'm so bad. Okay, spin. Uh, yeah, well. You guys are like, probably really, dude? All they're ever doing is spinning. You're capturing them. Why do I even keep doing it? That's a good question. Now, why aren't you guys automatically attacking? Maybe I haven't got you set for that. Focus on same enemy? Let's try that. Ooh, deflected. Okay, come on. 57%. All right. Will you? No, you're gonna you're gonna capture two. All right, fine. I'm not gonna complain, but I kind of would like to show what it does when it doesn't capture. And you can capture humans. Not sure if they serve a purpose in the game by capturing them. To be honest, I honestly don't know. I don't know if you can use them, utilize them for something, game-wise. Mm. Let's utilize that capture point. Okay, it's spinning. This one again. Okay. This is easy, another easy way to kind of capture pals is if something else is fighting them, wait for it's low enough to be at low enough on health and reap the benefits of them damaging it. Cheesing? Nah. Strategic planning. There we go. I'll go with that. 
Now why are you not attacking anything? Try for a headshot. You dodge, but you're not attacking. Uh, I don't want to waste my ammo or arrows on it, but I'm not doing a ton of damage either. And I'm sorry, I'm I'm not into capturing humans. Uh, maybe I mean I know some people or some videos I've watched where you capture um, some of the merchants. That might be fine, well and dandy. I don't know. I'm not sure. Haven't gone that route. Where am I? Oh, I'm heading away from base. There's a desolate church up there. And... Hmm. You know what? Let's explore. Worst case scenario, I die, right? That just means I have to find some place and spawn in and... Go back and get my gear. Ooh, is that arrows? That is arrows. Sweet. I only got eight arrows. Oh well. Let my fox sparks take them out. <laughs> That sound, which I can't du duplicate. But let's get some stat points. Oh, I have two points available. Um, health and weight. Sweet. What can we unlock? Um, I'm gonna leave those for now. I should go back to base and actually put the... Am I close to a fast travel point? I'm going away from it. Go figure. It's up there. Oh, but I hear... It's a unique ethereal sound. Does that mean that there's... Oh, a... Uh, um. Hmm. Yeah, one of those. I have eight. Please, Fox Barks, don't kill it. Or at least... Holy crud, that thing does some damage. And I don't do much damage to it. Oh my goodness. Good lord. Okay, I want that. A shiny. That's what they're called. Shinies. Oh my god. No more. Can I capture you now? Nope. One more time. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Come on. Okay, spin. Please spin. Awesome. Keep going. Sweet! I got a shiny! Don't really know what that means, but... From the... <laughs> hear the YouTube videos I watched? Shinies are good. So, I got a shiny. Um, I guess I'll figure out what that means later. I, well... Not necessarily true. Um, I don't have it on me. Of course not. Held that. Uh... And I'm not probably not going to be able to pick it up in here either. Um, yeah, it will have special abilities that normal pals of the same style won't have. Where am I? I am going way the wrong direction. I want to get up there somehow. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Like I said, this cold is absolutely kicking my back, backside. And I'm worried that it's only going to get worse. I probably should have leveled up stamina. Well, we'll see what I can do. Why do I want to get up here? 
Do I have any kind of a rhyme or reason or good idea? Mm. Oh yeah! Fast travel point. Durr. <laughs> good memory, just what? fairly short. Come on, go to the side. Thank you. Am I even... Um, hmm. Okay. Maybe it's still up. Most likely still up. And some people have said on other videos that, you know, if you get into other areas that are... Oops. Areas that are maybe a little less pal infested, that you'll find eggs? Yeah, I don't know. I seem to find eggs when I'm least expecting them, so in a way I'm kind of hoping for that. How many pal balls do I have? Oh, 39. Oh, I don't have any more arrows. Never mind. I thought I was shooting away, just do to do. Uh, well, thank you, Fox Parts, but I didn't put you away soon enough. My bad. There we go. And I'd heard this recent patch, the 1.4.1, fixed an issue with the lift monk effigies displaying that they increase your capture rate but they actually do the opposite. I heard that this patch actually fixes that which you go I don't even know if I have one built on my base maybe I did, maybe I didn't, I don't remember we'll see when I get back there arrows, gold coins, medical supplies but you collect the the lift monk e effigies and you can enhance your stats oh I haven't done it yet so capture power you do it one time it brings it up to one which I'm not sure what the percentage is with one two three four on up you can also enhance your party pals with um, lift monk or pal souls, regular ones I'm not sure what the pink ones are and I've never seen the yellow ones so I don't know where you would get those probably in the much higher level areas maybe when I was playing on console I did get a couple of the medium ones from one of the higher a little bit higher level area like a level 20-ish zone all right, let's go back to base. And let's put these Vixies to work. Um, what am I supposed to build? I don't have a campfire? I do have a campfire. Oh, I gotta put a pal back to work. Okay. Um, you're good at mining. And you're good at gathering. Uh, hold on. Is there anything left for you to mine? Yes, but... Oh my, you guys are in there. Fine, let's... How many Vixies do I have? Three. Let's do this. Let's take you guys out and put all three of the Vixies in. And they should head off to the farm. The, pal the lamb balls are great for working in the farm, giving you wool, which is great for making cloth. But with these mixies all grazing, if we go away and come back... Oh, I need to make another bed. Go away and come back. I'm not sure how long it takes them to do whatever they're going to do, but... They would just randomly dig up stuff, which is awesome. Okay, I need to build this. <laughs> I put all my workers away. Oh, figure. Oh, I guess I didn't. Thank you. Um, 
Katarina? Katarina. So let's pet you. And I believe this has a effect on their sanity level or sand level. It helps keep them um, working. Oh wait, here we go. They've already dug up some. So yeah, you just walk over, pick it up. So you can all you can have essentially an endless supply of regular pal spears. And they'll collect arrows for you, too. So that is phenomenal. All right, let's help Kativa pick up some of the stones that she mined. I think it's a she. Could be wrong. Let's find out. Yeah, I think it's female. And let's transfer everything we can. You have to be careful with this, with the this quick stack, because if, say, if there was one pal ball for some reason in here, pals like to put things in pretty much any chest that they can find any spot for. But if you happen to have a pal ball in the chest and you happen to hit quick stack, you could literally, all your pal balls will suddenly disappear, or all your arrows will disappear, you're like, oh, where'd my stuff go? So you kind of have to be careful with that. See, they put stone and wood in this chest. Do I... Is it inconvenient? A little bit. But they're putting stuff away, so how, how can I complain too much? They're helpful. Very helpful. And they have... Food... Cooked food does better for health, for health, for uh, filling up your hunger matter, Me meter. Wow, I'm so eloquent that I can't speak. Yeah, right, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Sure, not. However, the next pal that I really want for the farm, well, there's actually quite a few of them. I would love to get the Mazarina, which gives you milk in the farm. Um, a bee guard, which will give you honey. But the other one that I really want to find is a Mao, M-A-U, and they're in the caves. They will dig up gold. So you can have essentially an endless supply of gold just waiting for you when you come back to base. Okay, wait. Um, I can upgrade again? Awesome. Um, Pal gear workbench. Build a statue of power. Oh, cool. Um, Pal gear, gear workbench. Where should I put that? How about outside here? Clock. Oh, okay. Well. I'm gonna need, need another bed. Tea fins are awesome. Uh, also very good. They're water... Water pals. Because they will help with watering... Uh, the garden, so you won't have to seed it. Well, you'll have to seed it unless you have a pal that does seeding. But they will water it for you. Okay, so I can release another one. Um, Handyman electricity. The lift monks. Whoops. What am I? Details. Okay. They're good at planting. Ooh, yes. Planting, handiwork, lumbering. Medicine production and gathering. So that's perfect. Um, I actually need some production work. So let's, you know, let's check out the one that we got with the shiny. Mach Submachine gun. Hmm. I've not personally tried this, but I've heard it's amazing. But the, this one has a hydro laser 
interesting does 150 power the cooldown timer is a bit long 55 also wind cutter power of 30 but a cooldown of 2 so you could use this quite often motivational leader 25% work speed nice player work speed 15% work speed and 15% attack you know perfect so how about you go work in the garden planting um, but these are better at planting. Oh my. They are planting level 2. But she's destructive. Sanity drops, or san, whatever that is, drops 15% faster. I need a water. Yep, I need water. But since it's night, let's go quickly lay down. And we pass until morning. I love that, the rooster crows. <laughs> and we're hungry again. And Fox Parks is hungry. Okay, so... There they're doing that. There's the Tiefens. So let's go get us a water. Oh, I did. Okay, I did build. I was like, well, I knew I built something else, but I wasn't sure what it was. I built a series of traps. However, I am, maybe I need to just have them in better places, but I haven't managed to catch anything. because They just don't seem to be wanting to remotely walk into... An area. Let's see. Will you kill this on first shot? Hope not. Yes. Let's put you away. I don't want you killing everything. Capture. Spend. Okay. Perfect. Now we have... A pal. I keep wanting to say dinosaur. I'm so used to playing Ark. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Have one that'll actually um, water the garden. Perfect. And the left monk, she doesn't have. She? He? She. Okay, so the chief can go and water the garden. So now we have planting, watering, um, does any of them have gathering? Yes! The, the lift monk has a gathering, which is the green looking little flower things. The Tiva has gathering. Oh, so do the Dixies. Sweet! Okay. Oh, that's right. I need to make a bed. Um,. I probably should look at moving my base to the final area, but I think what I really want to do is wait until I can build two bases or have the second base opened up. Which one when is that going to be? Um, nope, wrong button. I don't remember what level that is. I know it's coming up where you can have two bases, and it's so much easier that then you can build another pal box, and you can fast travel between the two. Whereas right now, if I were to go up there and build and move the pal box, everything here could would it wouldn't get initially get destroyed, but there's a chance that some things that could. I'm not sure what those would be, but plus you lose the ability to fast travel. So if you have a lot of stuff in the chest, become over encumbered, and you move really, really, really slowly. Could take a long time depending how far you want to travel. Alright, let's go capture what we got here. So I got. What did I pick up? Arrows, obviously, and Pal Spears. So they are absolutely massively valuable. What level? Nine? Hmm. 
Are we high enough? 17. Let's, let's make some more arrows and let's go try a cave and see if we can get some mouse. Arrow. 15. No, I don't. What are you... Oh, heavens. I meant to help out. Oh, wait a minute. Do I have any pals that do... I do have the lamb ball. They will help out. Let's do that. Really? You don't want to help? Well, I know you're helping, so... Um, six arrows times three, twenty-seven. Let's go. One, one more set, and then we'll, we'll go. I mean, I'm sure I'm going to need more arrows than this. I'm probably going to die, but... Let's go adventure. I call them caves. They're probably called dungeons. Let's go. And hopefully... Well, yeah. So that's growing. Everybody has a bed. I'm not too hell encumbered. Nope. Okay, so... Where's the nearest cave? Right up there. Ooh, while we're up there, let's check and see if... The... Um... Oh my goodness, the thugs are back. The thug, thug fortress. So I don't know exactly how often that respawns. But I know it does respawn... I don't know if it's every other in-game day, every couple in-game days. I don't rightly remember. You know, I could have fast-traveled up here and saved a whole bunch of time. Silly me. And it has not respawned. You would literally see it right up there on that on that ridge if it were if it were to respond. Okay, so never mind. All right. Let's see what this cave slash dungeon. Hillside cavern, level thirteen. What's level thirteen, boss? Giddy up, right, right. Excuse me. Um. Hmm. Why is the number red on there? I don't know. Let's go with the least punk. Not sure what the benefits of that are. Syndicate thugs. That's the. Word. That's what they were. Okay. Now, in, the, in here, in the dungeons, is also a really nice thing. What? Is you can get sulfur. Oops. Okay. How about I pay attention to what I'm doing? That might be actually useful. <laughs> Get a little carried away thinking, being overconfident. Why is that least punk not doing anything? Oh, now you are. Fine. Daydream. Do I dare? Of course I do. I have. I, I dare. Just don't kill it. Oh, 26%. Okay, it spun. It spun again. Wow, this game's going to make me really work for it. But as I was saying, you can get sulfur. Oh, that's the axe. Or, and, um, where are they? Right up here. You can also get... Nope, that isn't it. Um, hmm. Maybe this one?
coal. You can get sulfur and coal inside these dungeons. So, yes, they're out in the overworld in other areas that are a little more dangerous, but these dungeons are scattered all over the place. And there's a good source of sulfur and coal early game, which we really don't have a use for yet because I haven't locked anything that requires it. But I have the option to go get it if I, if I want it. Um, how about you go attack? Because um, this could end up bad for me. Boy, that fire is super slow. I'm not going to complain because... She does a fair amount of damage. Actually, quite a bit of damage on her other shot. Thank you. Um, what I'm really looking for, though, hoping to find in one of these caves, was a Mao. Hmm. Anyway. Send you back out there. Gather their attention. Not me. You don't want to be. You don't want me. No, you don't want me. You want this. You want the Lee Spunk. Lee Spunk is your friend. Come and play with the Lee Spunk. Leave the silly human alone. Because he's just silly. So, what else we got in here? Oh, wait, I do have a torch. Durr. Like, why is it so dark? Duh, it's a dungeon and... Coins, arrows, okay. So, let's see what else we can get ourselves into. Six cents. Oh, that's right, they, they help find dungeons. Where were you on this one? <laughs> but I knew I, I knew where this one was, so I can't blaze, blame Lee's Punk on this one. Um, and this uh, area I went, up, um, yeah, it's here. It has th three different directions you can go. I just happened to pick left. I, I guess my mind, I was saying it, and one of these leads to the boss, and the other two which one I just went will lead to, essentially to a dead end but there's generally a chest and hmm with the risk of running this episode really really long I mean it's not longer than the longest episode obviously but hmm. on any game for that matter oh so I'm using yeah that works um, where was I going? Lost in train of thought. There we go. Just call it lost in translation. Which there's no translation, just me. Lost in thought. I was really, really hoping. Yes, I'm whining. I was really hoping for a Mao. I mean, it's still not too late. Oh. Go for a headshot. Oh. I completely forgot about being able to climb up. I never thought that was a thing. I didn't think you could climb. Well, obviously you can climb in this game, dear. Super fall. Um, but I don't think I can hit you from right here. Oh, yes, I can. And thank you. Bring out the torch so we can see again. And I thought maybe there was going to be a chest in here. 
Apparently not. Okay. So then that would leave the last corridor for the boss. And one other room. There's I'm going to guess this one splits. One goes off in a water path, and the other one goes off to a regular path. I'm not sure if that's the case or not. We'll find out. This Lee Spunk is working out pretty good. So far, so good. Okay, so yeah, it does split. And I believe that direction is to the boss. Um, let's go this way and see what's here. Okay, what are these? Fuddlers. I don't know what they do. Did I go... Let's try, let's try to capture one. Um... Would this be in my undoing? Possibly. Ooh. Yeah, you didn't seem very friendly. Please capture. Eh, nope. And of course, I was too far away, so you couldn't see. See, the sphere's spinning. Oh, really? Forget it. Hopefully... It's made sense that, you know, if, if the inner sphere spins, I don't know if it has to spin a certain direction, or if it's just for the fact that it does spin, it progresses. When it doesn't spin, then it has the chance to fight its way out of the PAL sphere. Which is no big deal, just throw down another PAL sphere. Or maybe damage it a little bit more and then increase the odds of capturing it. I'm not sure if that really, really, truly helps. I think it does. Maybe I'll test it. Maybe... Well... My testing... <laughs> hasn't been so... super successful. Help. I'm so glad that's tracking. What are you firing at? Just gonna show off and show me your power? Alright, fine, I can I can live with that. Show off. Although if I suppose if I could shoot out a big plasma ball or whatever that is, I would too. Alright. Small pals. So I got two of those. So I have the ability potentially yeah. to raise the stats of my pal. Excuse me. Alright, so are we ready for the boss? Probably not. Are we skilled enough for the boss? Probably not. Are we gonna do it anyway? Yep. Ooh. Uh a mouth. Awesome. Um. Oh, fudge. <laughs> Can I hit you from here? No, of course not. Um. I feel like such a dork running around with an arrow drawn. Please don't kill it. Hit it with a blast. Let's try. Ooh. Get ready to throw out another pal spear. Oh my goodness. Okay. So we did get the... Mal, like I was hoping to find. So we have a source of gold. Awesome. <laughs> Can't wait to put that in a farm. Daydreams are very, uh, very nice too, because you can make a necklace. And any pal that you have out, as long as she's wearing that, or you have that necklace crafted, 
you can end up having two pals out. So you can have a day on, day on, daydream, arc, and whatever pal. So if I have a Lee's Punk out, and I happen to have the, the necklace or bracelet, then I'll have a daydream and a Lee's Punk out. Oh, only a level 10 Katiba. Why did it say the dungeon boss was level 13? Whatever. Neither here nor there. Let's see if you can go and attack. Attack? Yeah. So I'm gonna hopefully not get Oh, no, 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 no. Not what I was hoping for. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I don't think so. You stay away from me. No, 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 no. Stay away. No, no, no. Go away. Go, go away. Oh, my goodness. And Lee's Punk is down. Okay, let's throw out... No, 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 no. I met you. Oh. Well. That didn't work as well as I had hoped. Okay. <laughs> let's respawn at bed. Or at my base. Hmm. Now, so much for the dungeon. What? Oh. Wrong button. Wrong button. Fast travel. Let's go here. And I... Bang! Yes! Your stuff will respawn outside of the dungeon. Which is perfect. Okay. Let's go back to base. Could go back in there and go after it, but I think I need some more help. Sort of a better choice of... I mean, Lee's Punk did well. Look at all these spheres. Oh my goodness. Absolutely, massively valuable. Um, but what I've got for pals... I don't think I need a lamb ball on me. That would not be good. Least punk, yes. Box sparks, yes. What do you have for damage? Ignis blast, and this one's serious. So I'll put you away. I haven't used you for anything. Um, daydream, poison blast, and dark ball. Lightning Blast. Wow. Okay, so let's take out one of the Pit Vixies and put in the Mao. So now we have gold and we have one that digs up stuff. Perfect. So we need to get some more pals to... Let's put a Spark Blast and Daydream. Should make a sh saddle for the rush ore. But, oh my goodness, it's nighttime again. Wow. <laughs> anyway, I think that one will actually be good for the day. Uh, if you like the video, please go ahead and smash the like button. Leave me some comments. Let me know what you think. Um, plus, I also like talking with you guys. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please consider, or please subscribe, consider subscribing, whichever. I really greatly appreciate it. I thank you for taking time out of your day to watch my video, and if you've made it this far, that is amazing. Thank you very much. I hope everyone has a great evening, morning, afternoon, any time of day that you see this, and I'll see you in another video.
Bye, guys.